This is your CBSLA.com News Brief. Hello, I'm Pat Harvey, and here's what's happening around Southern California. Tears and prayers for three South LA brothers found stabbed to death in their father's SUV. Family and friends held a vigil for the boys. Police say their father is hospitalized with self-inflicted stab wounds. A Huntington Beach school shut down because of asbestos contamination is back open. Hopeview Elementary was closed for 11 months. Parents say they are relieved the campus is up and running again. Our triple digit heat took a toll on some Riverside County firefighters. They got heat exhaustion while clearing brush. Police and sheriff's helicopters airlifted the sick crew members off a hill so they could be treated. And Southern California was hit with another round of wild weather. Rain was coming down in sheets in Valencia. Lightning strikes started two small fires along the five freeway. There was also some flooding. For the latest on these stories and your news any time of day, stay with CBSLA.com. I'm Jackie Johnson. Another chance of showers and thunderstorms will remain for the next few days as this tropical moisture will work its way into our area. Along with that, we will still have the extreme heat, especially inland and the valleys, back into the triple digits for the next few days. The heat and the humidity finally break, but not until next week. I am Gina Miller with a look at sports. The movie Roadhouse is one of those films that's so bad it's good. And now it's set to be remade starring Ronda Rousey. The UFC superstar tweeted about the opportunity today saying that it is a great honor to play a part in the remake. And the Lakers signed Brazilian guard Marcelo Huertas to a one year deal. Remember, you can always find the latest scores on CBSLA.com. And that's your CBSLA.com news brief. Remember, we're always on. Just click Listen Live on our webpage to hear KNX News Radio and our other stations live anywhere you are.